Well, what's up guys? Welcome to my fifth vlog from Barotsi Tiger Camp where we go into reports on the water levels and uh, show you a little bit of the fishing that's been going on over the last week. I've had an amazing week. I spent a few days on the boat being guided by Caleb Milne. He's one of the skippers here at Barotsi and uh, fishing with me on the boat was a lovely lady by the name of Cecily Mace who's a Zambian farmer and she comes up here fairly regularly to catch tiger fish and she loves catching them and fly so enjoy this little episode there's going to be a few catches and a nice little report on the water levels in front of Barotsi Tiger Camp. So let's start with the report on the water levels and um, the water's been dropping uh, all season been here since the 29th of April and been watching the water steadily go down so check it out this is what it's looking like today. So the water in front of the camp has been steadily dropping it's gone down from the 29th of April when we arrived in camp and it was up here on the fourth step it's now down on the 29th step and today is the 11th of June so it's gone down quite quickly but it's, it's slowed down, the rate of drop has slowed down somewhat but most of the bait that was in many of the floodplains is now in the main channels and uh, the fish are able to get at it and so there's been some good feeding going on. Right, so let's kick off with the fishing. The first clip that I've got to show you is a clip of Cecily catching a, about a seven pound tiger fish on fly. Uh, great achievement and something that she really enjoyed. How's that, Cecily? How's it feel? Cool. Putting a lot of work for that fish. Yes. Now you got him, eh? It's a beauty. Well, next up, Caleb found a really big bottle nose uh, as a live bait in one of the local cages where they keep the bait for Barotsi Tiger Camp. And he managed to convince Cecily to put down the fly rod for a while and he put out this big bottle nose uh, searching for a great tiger. So, Check this out and see what she managed to catch. Oh, look at that big one. Oh, big bottle nose. Let's catch Thank you, sir.
big tiger hooked here going around a stump and we're just busy trying to get the line off the stump still feel the fish on the other end and he's taking line and he jumped we saw him he's a big guy uh, check, check, check. Keep the rod in the water, that's it. Yes! Well done, Cecily. Well done, well done Cecily. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He had that big bottle nose, eh? What a fish. What a fish. Lucky you got him off the stump because if he had been stuck on there, he was never going to get off. Seventeen pounds. All right, seventeen pound Barazzi Express. How does that feel? Seventeen pounds of quivering fury. Yes. Well done, Cecily. Thank you. Wow, what an amazing privilege that was to spend that time with Cecily on the boat and witness her catching that incredible fish. I thoroughly enjoyed just being there and seeing the whole experience. And I also managed to get a few fish of my own over the time that I spent on the boat with Caleb and Cecily. So let's take a look at some of those catches. There's a lovely 13 pound Barotsi Express. These big tigers really haunt your nightmares and your dreams. Uh, I was one of my homemade jigs and uh, gave me a really good fight. Jumped out of the water a couple of times. Did some nice hard runs close to the boat. And no, uh, I was really excited. I'm thrilled to catch this fish. I'm putting in a bit of effort with the jig, so nice to get some reward. Thank you, baby. Put it back in the water and let it get some oxygen. So we're just giving this gorgeous fish a little bit of oxygen, letting it revive a little bit to release it and go on its way. He's a beauty. Right, come on. Good guy. Ah. Nice. Well, she swims back to her home and down in the depths. Hopefully she'll be none the worse for the wear for entertaining me today, giving me a bit of a good time. Lovely fat 11 pound Barossi tiger fish. Hit that jig really hard. Gave me a nice fight. Some massive jumps. I had my heart in my mouth. I thought it was going to spit the jig out. It stayed on. And yeah, having a great day here. The jig's working well. It's working as slow and deep near the bottom, and these fish are eating it. So that's the way it should be. Let's get it back in the water. Go. And away she goes. Lovely. I enjoyed that. So those are just a few of the highlights that we had over this last week here at Barotsi Tiger Camp. I'm always absolutely blown away by the sheer quality of the tigers that we catch here. Uh, just incredible fish in this part of the Zambezi. And I really look forward to 
as the season unfolding and seeing what we catch because apparently the fish just get bigger and bigger the later the season gets so it's going to be amazing keep tuned subscribe if you want to see my videos and just keep up to date with what we're catching here at Barotsi.